Hey guys, so today I'm here with a review of Mirror's Edge for the iPhone and iPod Touch. Uh, now this is of course a uh, adaptation from the uh, consoles and of course the PC, Mirror's Edge, which I was a big fan of. It's a really, really great looking game, great playing game. Um, and now of course you can go ahead and pick it up on the iPhone and the iPod Touch. So I'm going to go ahead and jump right on in here, in here and just go ahead and do a speed run. Uh, now this is going to be pretty simple. I'll try to explain the controls. Uh, it's, it's pretty unique and it, it does work pretty well. Um, now one thing I do like are the loading screens. As you can see here, you can actually go ahead and scroll through here. Basically what this does is kind of give you a little bit of background and everything. Um, the story is basically the same, although it's tweaked a little bit, but it's basically the same as what you would find on the other consoles. Um, I won't get into that, I'll just show you guys some gameplay. Uh, it does look really quite nice on you know, the iPod and iPhone screen. Um, pretty good. So we can go ahead and just do this. Now the way it works is you need to go ahead and uh, run. By She'll automatically run. You can go ahead and just run and jump and all that kind of stuff. So run over to that. Um, you know, there are there are a bunch of different things, but the cool thing is is that a lot of the feel has remained the same. So we can go ahead and oops, that's not very good. But um, a lot of the feel has remained the same. You really do need to keep up your momentum. Um, you know, if you you know you mess up a little bit, you definitely will cause some problems. Like I should have slid under that, but I'll try to get the next one. There we go. And and there are several other things. Let's jump up here. Um, but it, like I said, it does re remain a lot of the feel of the console. You know, you need to keep your momentum up. Um, slide on it here, and I think we're almost done here. Run across here, run up here, and we slide down to roll. Now, but this is pretty simple, so we can just quit running here. And sorry, I'm not paying attention to this glare. So we wall run and barely got it. Jump up over here. Um, but as you can see here, the game runs very nice and smoothly. Uh, it looks really, really quite nice. Roll down. Oh, that was nice. Um, so there we go. It does run, look very, very nice. Um, you know, it's not going to be. It, obviously, it doesn't look quite as good as it does on you know the Xbox, or whatever. But this is, of course, a different kind of style. Um, let's jump across here. Roll. Ah, we're doing pretty good here. And there we go. We got it. Didn't do very well. Um, but there you go, guys. So that's Mirror's Edge for the iPhone and the iPod Touch. Um, now this is currently also a dollar, along with several other EA apps. So for a dollar, this is definitely something you have to get. Um, you know, I've been having a lot of fun. I've played through it. I've got to play through it again now. But um, so guys, if you're interested, go ahead and check it out. It's just Mirror's Edge in the App Store.